Hello, everybody. Um, I'm Mark Carter Fan 98. How you doing? <laughs> I had to throw that in there. Something new that I'm starting. Um, I am making a 500 subscriber contest video uh, for Mr. Fisher Bite. And um, he wants you to number one. Uh, Put a comment down below, not on my video, on his video, and uh, on the initial 500 contest is what is titled. So uh, I'm going to make a comment, and now I'm making the video. I haven't made the comment yet, but I will after the video. But anyway, my I actually got 10 cards here. Um, I couldn't, it's, it's really hard to decide which autos, I mean, I love all of them, but um, believe it or not, I'm a Vince Carter fan, and um, I like this auto, but I don't like the, how the product was made, because it was made cheap, in my opinion, I like the autograph. And I like the numbering on the card and I like the design. But I think the card, these car, this particular product that Panini made this year was made really, really cheap, in my opinion. Because uh, it's just like with any product, a brand new product when they first come out, it's... They, they try something to see if it works, and then they build up on that. So maybe next year, this product will be better. So far, number 10, um, I always collect Vince Carter autos that have the his jersey number uh, signed beside his name. Um, very seldomly do you see his autos without the 15 on it. So, the number 10 auto of Vince Carter, and this is a shitty product, but I like the card anyway, is black and gold, baby. What up, Greg Thomas? There's my black and gold Vince Carter, number 49. Um, I was going to send this off to BGS to get it graded, but this little silver thing, this little silver thing right there, fell out and it's got some chipping issues on the front of the card and I actually won this in a in a Raz from somebody I think it was um, I'm not even going to say this is a video for Mr. Fisher Bike I'm not here to to plug anybody except for him because he's a man son uh, Mr. Fisher Bike my um my ninth my number eight card and um is the king bay matumbo from gold standard that's my number nine card and i'm actually uh trading this for something that I really want better than this. I like I like uh, Dikembe Mutombo. He was a good ball player. He's a good veteran, and uh, I think he's a Hall of Famer. I'm not sure, but I think he is. Uh, but it's number to 99. I was going to send this one to Beckett too, but uh, I thought I, I was looking for something, and. Apparently he wants to wait, so we shall wait. Uh, my number uh, seven card would be um, Juan Gonzalez uh, from Museum, number to one ten. This got a. I just sent this off two months ago. I got a nine point five with a nine auto. Whoops. Here, let me turn this way. But you guys can see it and I might 
I'm looking for an upgrade on the patches. Get an upgrade on, on the patches. So if you see any with patches in this card, let me know. Uh, 9.5 with a 9 auto. Of course, that really don't matter about the auto. I, I'm, I'm not into the grading the auto anyway. If it gets a 7 or 6 or a 5 or a 4, who cares? Um... I'm a Texas Ranger fan as well as a giant New York Giants fan. Um, I got a 2015 Top Supreme um, autographed. It's got Juan Gonzalez, um, 9.5 with a 10 auto on this one. Got a 9.5 with a 10 auto on this one. This is OCA, but it's also non-numbered, I think, yep, non-numbered. Somebody should be sending me another one. Uh, my number six card, or the next card, is uh, 2014 Topps Chrome Mini of Andre Williams Pink Refractor Autograph. Uh, sent this in. To get it graded, we got a PSA 10, and this card is numbered to 75. I'm looking to upgrade it to a uh, upgrade the uh, pink refractor to a red refractor. So I'm looking for the red. Can't find it. Um, got a PSA 9 on this one. Uh, the next one, uh, 2014 Top Strata. Um, I really don't like Strata, but I like the patches. Um, um, the clear cut autos are really nice, but it just doesn't look good in a PSA case. I think it would look better in a Becky case. So, but we um, got a 9, PSA 9. And this one is numbered to 75. And the next auto is a 2005 Luxury Box. And these autos are really, really um, sensitive uh, to chipping. Uh, I bought four. I bought four and I sent all four in. And this is the highest grade that I got. Uh, one man show autograph of my man Vince Carter. And as you can tell, there's no number 15 by his name. So if you see one of these cards that has an auto on it and it has a number 15, please let me know. Thank you. Uh, the next one is a 2015 top uh, Panini Contender Dylan Tate. College rookie, college ticket auto, um, cracked ice. This is number two twenty three. He is the fourth round draft pick in the first round for the two thousand fifteen MLB. Um, and uh, he's a Texas Ranger. And that's the reason I bought it. 2015 and I actually got this one cheaper than I did some of these regular uh, contenders so I actually got a good deal on that one and that was I bought this one like right after the draft like right after the draft ended I bought it because I wanted to see who what Texas Ranger I wanted to PC this year uh, actually I was PC last year but couldn't find anything, any autos uh, that much, except for Leaf. And I'm really not into college baseball that much. I'm, I like college basketball, but not college baseball. Uh, this is the number two auto. Um, I had two of these. Um, one came back, I think, a seven. And the other one came back a ten. So I gave this one... I gave the other one, I think I gave it to, to a friend of mine 
that's doing the 500 contest, I believe. I think I gave it to him. I can't remember. I'm old. Stop bugging me. Uh, but anyway, uh, 1998 Collector's Edge, Vince Carter, Impulse, Pro Signatures, PSA 10. And this one has got the number 15 on it. And this was from 1998, guys. So there's a 15 right there. And there are autographs. There are cards like this that have Vince Carter's autograph on it. But the ones that have the 15 are the non-die cut. The ones that have the die cut autos, they don't have the 15 on them. He didn't put 15 on that. And last but not least, what football auto is complete? My top 10 um, right now, my top, top 10 all-time auto set uh, is a 2015 Spectra. And I wanted a 2004 auto because that's his rookie year, but they're so expensive. And I won this one in a break. Um, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Um, um, somebody gave me this. Somebody gave me this. Um, but anyway, um, and I haven't sold it because I like I like this quarterback. Um, and he's actually a giant, so that narrows it down pretty well. Uh, 2015 Panini Spectra, uh, Signatures Neon Green, Eli Manning, and this card is numbered to a five. This uh, number two. Oh, hmm. There you go. Number two of five. And got a mint nine on it. I was hoping for a 10, but it got a mint nine. I'm happy with that. Um, if it would have came back a six or a seven, I probably would have cracked it out and just put it in a magnetic. But anyway, um, that's my top 10, uh, Mr. Fisher Bike. And uh, I really appreciate you doing the contest. And uh, I'll send the link to the video in a PM. Thanks, guys.